Well, yeah, the, you know, a lot of the fallow syndrome experience, at least in South Dakota, came at a time when, when tillage was king. And, and we know that the mycorrhizae fungi are greatly reduced in tilled systems. And that's one thing I've, I've kind of wrestled with the last month or two is in our, in our really uh, mature no-till fields, we have a high level of fungi. And so how far was that set back with a year of fallow? You know, uh, can we still benefit from, from what's left there in the soil? And, and I tend to, my opinion would tend to say, it, it probably is better than if it was a tilled field left fallow. And so I think it's, it's better. Uh, are we going to see some fallow syndrome? I think we are uh, in some places, but uh, um, I'm running into uh, exactly what, 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 Ross, uh, what Ross mentioned. I mean, uh, uh, there's a concern, but not, not all that much about it. Uh, of course, we know that if we ban some phosphorus, uh, we, can, we can take care of it. Uh, Antonio Malarino from Iowa State is saying if you don't have banding equipment on your uh, planter, uh, that just increasing the broadcast rate of P 20 to 30 pounds can overcome that as well. Uh, so yeah, like you said, there's a whole bunch of uh, opinions out there about it. Some are trying to make a, a huge deal out of it. The sky is falling type thing. And, and I, I'm, I'm somewhere in the middle there. And I think our soil health systems are going to show some resi resilience when it comes to that. So. I think we might have more of a problem just because of the amount of rainfall we've had and stuff. It's taken a lot of the oxygen out and stuff in the very top surface there. If you don't have good infiltration and stuff, that the water just couldn't go anywhere. The whole profile was full, and I think we might have lost some right. biology that way. But yeah, there's there's definitely areas, especially you know where Kurt's from, uh, totally different soils than we're sitting with 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 the three of us here, but. Uh, uh, yeah, lots of saturated soils, and, and it, it, it may be more of an issue there with fallow syndrome than... That's where I think yeah. we might, just from a saturation standpoint, not that we necessarily lost some fertility or nothing that was growing there, just took it out that way. Mm -hmm.